Hello and welcome to this Dwarf Fortress Adventure Mode tutorial where I will show you how you can equip your companions, how you can trade items with them and if you so choose to you can even uh, steal items from NPCs or any other creatures in the game. At the time I'm recording this the version is 3404, but that doesn't really matter. What you need is a DF hack version that is compatible with the version you are running. In fact, I have installed at the moment the version 3403. But uh, the DF hack needs to be compatible with the version you have, and it needs to have a command called ADV body swap. And DF hack is installed in the Dwarf Fortress uh, directory, uh, overwriting some files, and when you fire up for fortress, DF hack will at the same time fire up its own window, this uh, command line console. And when you have this open, let me fire up my character here, you are able to swap bodies with any creatures in the world. And how this works is if you want to trade items, you take your main character, and I will drop here an iron cap. And uh, I will drop an um, Iron Morning Star on the ground, right here. And then I will either look at the details of a character, like this, or in case of companions, I choose companions with C and choose uh, this uh, pikeman here. And when this detail window is open, I have my DF hack window here. I will give the command adv body swap. And as you saw in the Dwarf Fortress window, I now swapped bodies with this companion. So I am now effectively controlling this Mace Man here instead of my main character, uh, Hammer Man named Dotu. So I will walk with this companion on top of these items and I will get the Iron Cap. I will wear it. I will get to Iron Morning Star. This character uh, hurt its uh, hand and dropped the weapon, so this was the way for me to equip the companion again. To swap back into the main character, you can either, uh, in the similar way, look at the main character, or just in the main window without anything selected, you give the same command again. And uh, you have returned in the body of uh, whatever your character is, so here I am. And now, if I look at my uh, companion, he's now in fact wearing the iron cap and has an iron morning star in right hand. In a similar way, I can, uh, I think this is a bit of a cheat, but you can steal items from uh, any NPC in the world. The, it works in the same way. You look at, for example, this bowman is not my companion yet, so I am looking at him. And this requires one addition to the command. You give advanced body swap and you need to add force. You can also uh, body swap permanently. Uh, for example, I haven't tested this myself, but you can uh, start adventuring with, uh, well, I guess any character or at least companions if you give uh, advanced body swap permanent. Like this, but I'm not going to do that now. So, uh, with NPCs that are not your companions, give advanced adv body swap force. Sorry, my bad. One thing, one thing I forgot. I don't, I don't know this bowman yet. Uh, so I need to talk with him. And now I know this character's name. So let's do that again. Let's look at this uh, Rockville, Rockville the bowman. And let's give that command again. And we have swapped into the body of this bowman. And now, uh, this could be any any NPC. Let's say I want to steal this fellow's, um, well, underwear. What's more proper? So let's remove the underwear, and then let's drop it. And then let's give the body swap command again. And we have returned to the body of our main character. We will move into this screen and pick up this guy's underwear. We have effectively, effectively stolen the underwear of this bowman and he has no idea. Um, uh, excuse me, she, oh my. <laughs> we stole the panties of a, from the female bowman. Okay, well, anyway, 
I hope you uh, found this Dwarf Fortress tutorial uh, helpful. Uh, put this into use in your adventures. This way you can give any item to the companions just like you can equip your main character. You can give them full iron armor, full steel armor or adamantine if you are lucky enough to find such and uh, all that good stuff. And no, no longer the companions uh, run out of bolts, they don't run out of arrows because you, you can give them more. You can make them carry stuff, give them a backpack, put that, put that backpack full of food. Put one companion to be a mule, uh, hauling all kinds of stuff for you. And uh, if you so want to go and find the most powerful um, enemy enemy out there and swap swap into that enemy's body, and uh, I guess you can go adventuring as outlaw. I don't know if you chose to choose to. But uh, as said, if you want this um, tutorial helpful, please hit the like button. Uh, leave comments if you have any any questions or such, and I'll be. I'll be happy to answer any any questions you have. I guess that's it. Uh, go play Dwarf Fortress Adventure Mode. It is awesome. All the links and instructions in the video description. Now, take care. Bye bye.